they kind of wreck it in the dry season and the, for Camel Trophy they always won't go back in the wet season when it's most difficult. When we did it, it was the 14 teams, there's four or five support vehicles, so it's about 20 old Land Rovers and uh, and they just kind of, it's, it's, there's a few little competitive elements but the majority of the two weeks in, out there is doing a thousand miles is like just helping everybody else working together, building the bridges that are washed away. And they reckon it was kind of the toughest one and at times we actually had to have local guys, their tractors pulling us through, it just became, it's meant to happen in two weeks, they kind of wreck it a thousand miles and they, with the competitive elements they planned for it to take about two weeks but it's, we were getting really well behind schedule, we were getting really bogged in and some days we did, oh like you know, a mile or something of winching every car through a piece after we built a bridge and it just became a real mud bath kind yeah. of slog yeah so it's like yeah it's a real it is a bit of a marathon job but it's you know you're only going to do it once you only get one chance at it you can never do it again 